Yes, hello. How are you out there? It is Sonia and Matt. We are feeling kind of fine and fancy tonight because we got a new family member in the house. You know, when everybody's all under your roof and they're all tucked in and they're all underneath, like in one place, you just feel that happy joy. We have got like hearts full of love tonight because Pete is now with us. That, if that, you've been following us, that, what? Pete's like another member of the family, dude. Come on. Get I, I get it, it but. You know, as a mom, you know when your children are all tucked in. I, I wouldn't know. Up, right? I would know. And God love Pete, okay? Pete has been waiting for us to bring him home, all right? He, <laughs> now, for those of you who are wondering, Pete, you guys, of course, all already know Pickles, the boy monkey. We got, it's, you know, good boy, does what he's told, sticks to pretty much everything under the sun. Where you put him, he stays, right? Miss Petunia, oh, no, 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 no. She's a little girl. She's the little girl monkey on our milkshake, milk paint. And uh, she can turn your world upside down, right? Do some beautiful, chippy, spontaneous effects because you can't keep her butt still and you never know what she's going to do. And my friends, tonight, tonight we bring into the family Pete. And so for those of you who are wondering, just this, give is, them a, a, this just, is a sibling, okay? Yeah, fill it in. Just give it a couple minutes so everybody gets in the house. Everybody get in the house? <laughs> yeah. Good deal. So, yeah, Pete is a sibling to Pickles and Petunia. So... Are you guys excited tonight? Like, all oh, how our family has grown. I'm curious, how long have you guys out there been watching us? Watching the journey of Junk Monkey come to life? A lot of you guys might remember that Junk Monkey Paint Company started as a started in our house, in our garage, in our kitchen, because when I didn't have heat in the garage and I didn't have lights in the garage, I would literally pull the furniture into my kitchen and sit on the floor. I still have the paint marks over the walls to show for it. And it started off as Sonia Shabby Chic. Sonia, I'm Sonia. This is my partner in crime, my husband, Matt, who's behind the scenes with me today. Don't tie me into uh, this. He has supported my crazy dreams, you know. I've been pulled into this whole thing. You know, God love him. And, uh, yeah, he's over there shaking his head like, oh, yeah, right? So, and I'm thankful for you guys that have been a part of the journey. You know, guys know here at Junk Monkey that we put our heart and our love into everything we do, right? And we believe about quality over quantity, and we believe about, about that, you know, the slow chug of the journey, you know what I mean? And uh, just taking our time and doing it the right way. I'm living in a van down by the river. <laughs> How many times have you guys said, Sonia, will you ever bring out, you know, bring out some shimmer, I've heard you guys call it, right? Bring out a metallic paint. Oh, good things come to those who wait, my friends, and me included, because we're going to have a lot of extra fun. We're feeling extra here at the Junk Monkey because Pete is in the house, all right? Matt, who's with me tonight? Are there's they ready to hear about Pete? I think Pete? there's a lot of people here ready okay. to meet Pete. All right, I'm gonna show you Pete, okay? <sighs> Say it with me, God love Pete, okay? <laughs> Petunia, and now we have Pete, all right? I want you to see Pete in all his glory. Do you see him there? I'm gonna show you up close to Facebook. YouTube and Facebook is in the house tonight. Give me a hashtag, banana bunch, if you're feeling the love and you uh, are part of our wonderful community here. Can you guys see him over there as well on YouTube? Yeah, you were good right where all you right, were. Right where I was? Okay, this is Pete, all right? And you're going to pull out Pete when you've got big, shiny dreams for your furniture, all right? So, Pete, all right? Pete is a rock star, let me just tell you, all right? And he's reaching, you know what I mean? Do you see him? Junk monkey metal, all right? He's got dreams. He's got big dreams of making it big on the stage. And let me just tell you, when you pull him out to work on your furniture, he will light up your furniture in a pretty, pretty amazing way, right? And make it all shiny rock stars. No, it's it's Thanks. a true it's a true metallic with metallic in it. Yes, so, yeah. absolutely. Oh yes. Oh yeah. It's That's not it. a glitter paint. It no, is. but it will make your furniture sheen. I'm gonna use it tonight. I've got some projects behind me, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. But yes, you can probably see on the front. It is our. This is the, this is the part where we talk about doing things with love and thoughtfully, that it is a one-step metallic paint and sealer all in one, okay? So think about this. You guys know, like, when as I teach you on here, for anybody who is new on our page, Man, there's some old school know, people on really? here. Yeah. Oh, I want to hear all about it. So you guys know on here, I teach you guys for free. I have been painting furniture to sell and decor to sell. Other people's junk is has been my treasures, and I've passed it on to so many people. Um, and I'm so thankful for the journey that I've had, right, with, with doing that. <laughs> but when I think about where we started to where we are now, this is going to be a piece of the pie that, that's just so awesome to be able to do, right, and to be able to, like, put a whole other design on furniture. So, yes, so I started to say that on here I teach you guys how to do tutorials for free. 
and uh, I share with you all the ways that I basically repainted furniture and it's all sold and gone on to great homes and now I teach that for free right here wide and open on my page and so I'm thankful for those of you who are joining me here we are in the middle kind of halfway the middle point of our furniture paint challenge we're going live for 30 days straight this is day what Matt 22 day 22 22 is my favorite color who knows that right favorite color favorite, sorry, favorite <laughs> day I'm, I'm just thinking about poor Pete here I love Pete I'm gonna let him out of the can in just a second right so he can play and uh, you know just let his dreams you know his big shiny dreams get out of this can and onto my furniture and onto my uh, paint decor. But I teach you guys how to glaze, right, on top of our paint. And when you add glaze on top of paint, it gives you a whole other look, right? You guys know we have like the brown and we have the black and we have the white and we have the teal. And so sometimes you, uh, you know, you want to add a little something extra, whether it's on top of that glaze and on top of that paint. And maybe sometimes you want to bring out some iridescent colors, right? Some metallic, some sheen, um, you know, definitely some shimmer, right? For all you guys that love to add a little bit of an extra something-something to your piece, this is going to be a whole other part of the pie. So this is a Bajakama Jade. Can you guys see this? Can you see this in this here? Do you see the sheen that's on here? I'm going to show you tonight a little bit how I play with it and how you can make your furniture pieces stand out in a whole other way. Do you see the sheen? Do you see it, yeah, the gold, right? Do you like gold? All this, all yes. this gold. So the color that I'm going to show you guys tonight, now, let me show you the actual can. By the way, it is live on our website, okay? We, we just put up on our website everything. And I'm going to go ahead and show you real quick up close. So the color of the metallic pigment that is in this paint and sealer or top coat, whatever you want to call it in your verbiage, is a color called champagne, okay? Champagne, do you guys see it? You see it right there? You're picking up what I'm laying down right there? Ooh, that yumminess right there goes a long, long way. So this color of pigment that we packed into Pete's lovely little bow here into his can um, is champagne. And so for any of you guys out there that, you know, are always like, well, what should I use? Should I go gold? Should I go silver? I'm not really sure. I don't want to pigeonhole myself into something. Did you know that champagne is the happy medium? Champagne is the, the metallic that blends into silver and blends into, coal, into gold. It's the happy medium. So or happy to be able to launch to you. The most important shimmer, metallic, paint, Thanks, sealer, Mary. all of one that you need in your toolkit, the champagne style, okay? So we're gonna have some fun tonight. I am so excited. And with that, Matt, will you tell me who is with us? Because I love no one who is in the house. All right, we got oh, tons of people in the house. Uh, if you lost the video, go out, come back in. Um, we're late getting in here tonight, as some of you guys were wondering because we're not late. We were, we've been working, yeah, we've been working with Pete all day long, yes. getting him up on the yes, website uh, to let you go, uh, to let you know that uh, this week, um, this is a true metallic paint without the true metallic paint cost. Um, he's going to be 24 a can for a pint plus. Uh, most... Most Crazy. metallics at eight ounces are 33 and up. Yeah. So we worked hard to bring it. Double the amount for less than like what you would typically see for. And you get a sealer in it yeah. that those don't the provide you. But this weekend we're selling it all. And we're gonna sell it for 24 hours. Yep, 24 hours. We're doing it for 20 bucks. Yep. And so tonight we're giving as well. You two share. cans away. Yes. We're giving a can away on Facebook with. Banana bucks, 20 banana bucks. So basically, and we a have can. four giveaways yep. instead of two. Yeah. Right? And a can on YouTube yep. and, and a banana can bucks. On Facebook. Yeah. So exactly. So $20 in banana book, bucks. Books. To one lucky banana person books. Who shares this video and type share below. We'll, we'll be able to see if you shared it. And then um, also a can of Pete. <laughs> of Pete. <laughs> Everybody will be in the store looking for Pete tomorrow. Um, uh, Pete is on the shelves and on the website. You don't have Pete. to put it on a painted surface, no. No, no, no. You no. just want to add a little bling bling, right? Yeah. yeah. To uh, some brownie brownie furniture because yeah. it's a sealer and a bling bling all in one, right? So let's start here, right? Do you see this board right here? Now let's go. You can see it. It's kind of like looks normal. And then you turn it up and you start getting the sheen. See the sheen? Yep. So this is a very light uh, sheen on top. It actually looks more, uh, just kind of dry more gold on here. Yeah. This is a second layer. This is a third layer. And then finally, if you go solid, you can see that reflection of the uh, 
metallic. Yeah, you can intensify it how you do it. But if you can see the shimmers, the board moves like on top. It doesn't cover up all your work and it gives it that nice little gold shimmer. There you go. So I'm gonna paint Is banana peel food safe? Um, if you're doing anything around food as a chef, I would use the uh, uh, monkey, shine? monkey shine. Yeah. Um, our nice. banana peel is water-based acrylic. Um, it is non-toxic, but I wouldn't put it around food. Yeah. Well, you know? be honest with you. Yep. So we're just anyway. not a fan of putting food on paint of any paint surface. Yep. So there you go. <laughs> Happy birthday, Matt. Enjoy the carbs and beer. I got to be real honest with you. So we went, and uh, we actually started last night, and. We uh, ate carbs, and, and we didn't go crazy, but I'm regretting it. <laughs> My so, body is not made to run on carbs anymore. I'm like... Do you see that really cool, like, just, like, pearl iridescent shiny finish that's going on here? It's, it's going to set up, right? So this just goes from um, Bahama Jade and dry to a velvety flat mat, to now I've got some sheen on to it, okay? Right. So just real quick while Matt's chatting, I just want you to know, I'm just dry brushing it on, okay? Real quick, over the top of it with my shabby chip brush, with just a light coat all around, and now, you know, you're painting a piece of furniture, now you can have that beautiful sheen to it. Because some people like a little glam, you know what I'm saying? A little yep. rustic shabby glam. And we find out, too, as, as Pete dries, he intensifies a little bit. Yes. So, you know, we're just going to leave this here. I'm just doing a light brush over with him to add that really cool shimmer to this. Right. And uh, let me make sure I got everything there. Do and the... I'm using my shabby chip brush because you know what happens when I do shabby, right? Shabby style gets distressed and it's not so heavy, so, right? So you guys can see that board sitting in the light, how, uh, especially on YouTube, the reflection of the shimmer off of it is, oh, uh, right yeah. Yeah, absolutely. So we've been like, there's like little bits of shimmer all over the shop. <laughs> yes. So now we've, we've yeah. Saw you, saw you look like the shimmer elf out shimmer there going, Woo! Shimmer here, shimmer there, right? Yes. I'm telling you, the eye likes dimension. Not everybody wants, you know. Yeah. Of course, we all love vintage. But sometimes yeah. you like a little bit of glam with it, right? Yeah. I am spending my weekend, my birthday weekend with you guys. And it, it's, there's no other place to be, to be honest with you, so. Anyways, with me and uh, right now, almost 400 of my closest friends. So. Oh, that's so awesome. And then everybody jumps oh, off, as I say. I love it. <laughs> Anyways. This really, so can, be, say, can Pete be outside? Absolutely, Pete yeah. can be outside. Yep. How many coats does it usually take to seal something with regular poly? Uh, a poly yeah, just yeah, one. one. Every layer you add, this is going to add yep. another layer of protection. All right, so, so real quick, I dry brushed some Eric, of my metallic you, hot coat all over do it. Do you want to hit this real uh, quick? I'll just let it come because I got a little bit more yeah. to do. Because I've got these bowls that have yeah. been holding my supplies, and I'm just going to pan them. Today. He is fantastic for highlighting. Yes, he is. Oh, you can probably see a little bit darker now as I'm putting it over the yellow, mm. and then we'll let him set up real quick. But I'm doing shabby brush style. Yeah. Again, if I want Where is Lori right Scott, here, well. the yeah. Shimmer Queen? Is she here? She is not. Oh, she has been like. And I haven't on. seen Linda Linda or Gaylene. Oh, man, <laughs> what are we going to do? So. Oh, guys, I love how this looks. Okay, so I have been, here's what this reminds me of, okay? If you've been following me on my Instagram stories, uh, which if you're not following me on Instagram, yeah. you need to because there's more behind-the-scenes stuff. Yeah. A little bit more probably up-close and personal kind of stuff, like stuff like, oh, guys, you know. I, I, I have today. to say All for, I have to say that uh, Pete, the, the shimmer, when you go yes. one coat, it, it's very, I, I'm, I going, I'm going to use this word. I'm using dainty. I'm going to use this word. What? Sophisticated. Yes. Yes. Gives dimension. Okay. So I started to say how if you follow me on Instagram, I, one of the things I've been telling you guys that I did was I started taking pottery classes. Who saw that, right? Mm -mm, mm -mm. And I showed you my very first pottery pieces. Anyhow, I got to glaze and see how you did pottery. And when I first started working with paint and putting them on painted pieces, that's what it made me feel. It made me feel like I was glazing pottery because it gives just such a nice, um, like, you know, when you get that nice glaze on it, like if you've ever done um, pottery, it just has a nice finish mm -hmm. onto it, like, you know, a nice sheen. And you can see him already starting to set up here. Yeah. Can you see that? Yeah, you can use the heat gun. You can use the heat gun on this. That is you not can. an issue. We've been somebody, using the heat gun all yeah. day. But um, I'm not somebody who likes to rush my top coat, Yeah, right? the pink color. I don't tend to use my heat gun on Mod Podge 
or top coats unless I really need to. Like I'm speeding up for right. you guys. The pink, the pink color is actually Sweet Sunset. So, just right. like Sweet Sunset, yeah, yeah, with pink. This is. Uh, sunshine yellow. Do you see how it mellows it out? Because yeah. you can have it, it almost gives it with that light one. What I say, it almost looks like oh, actual, yeah. like glass pottery is what you know, like ceramic pottery, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I got these uh, candlesticks for two ninety nine a piece, and they're kind of funky and colorful. I like them, but I am going to actually put them in black. <laughs> Martha, we have black. the eyeliner effect and the highlighter effect. There you go. Yes. Yes. Exactly. Oh, they want to see Pete. Pete. Peter. Pete. People are, yes. are late, so let's... Uh, Alright, so look at these candlesticks. Well, I'm showing them, Pete. And Pete's. now we're going to go ahead and put some color on Alright. There's Petey. So there. Pete's yeah. got big dreams. Big shiny dreams. He's a rock star. So, anyway, so of course champagne. We're starting with champagne. And for Tess, who just said hi. Hey, Tess. How are you, girl? Silver is in the works right now. Yeah, we were saying that as well on Don't Make Me Blush. It's going to look uh, look really good, actually. I'm going to this over here so I don't get all my yep. black on my uh, so. All right, so I am going to take these candles <laughs> for $2.99, put them in our chalky style black velvet because it sticks to pretty much anything under the sun, which means that I don't care what this, what these candlesticks are ooh, made out of. All I know is I am going to make them black and fancy and so <laughs> all these colors. Well, actually, yes. Okay. So, I don't know if... Uh, we, we do have DNA results. What's that? We have DNA results, yes. somebody asked. The results are in. The results are in. And what is it Jerry Springer says? Shock and awe. There you go. So, it turns out Miss Sonia is... Three things. Three things, that's it. Three I'm things. I'm a simple girl. I'm a simple girl. She is. Yep. 82%. Yep. English. Yes. 82% English. She is 10% Scotch Irish. You are the father. And as the rumors, as the rumors have persisted, they are true. She is 8% elf. <laughs> that is, she is. Swedish Laplander from Angerman land. <laughs> so, so we found out, yes, she is part elf. That's why she goes, she's like Buddy the Elf on Elf because she never stops. She's 100 miles per hour and she paints all day and just works, 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 works. Yes. So there you go. There you go. I, I heard stories about um, growing up when our family would have... Uh, came over from, what area is that now? Sweet, Lapland. Yeah, Lapland and... Um, reindeers. Believe it or not, they heard reindeers. Yep, they were brought over to uh, pool sleds, reindeer, pool sleds. So, from being up north, that was a connection. And, um, you know, when you, you hear things, stories passed down in your family, and then you buy a DNA kit, and you actually <laughs> find out that some of the, you know, the stuff that you're hearing has been true. Yeah. You know what amazed me, though? Is that and I had, they just came in uh, earlier today. Yeah, so it's been a big day at the Jump Monkey. Yeah. We've big been day. so busy and I haven't had a chance to really like, because if you've done the DNA, Ancestry DNA, um, that like we did, then you can go online and it'll like tell you all kinds of stuff like migration of your family and all kinds of things like that. And, uh, and also your cousins. <laughs> and I'm like, holy moly, I didn't know I had this many cousins. Like, who are you? So... You know, yeah, we could be uh, we could be related. So if you get a message from me through, through ancestry DNA, she wants to hear from you. Yes. And and Gaylene's not on, but she obviously she has family, has family yes. in New yes. Zealand. Yes. And where's Jenny T's? Tasmania and Australia. So yes, we could there be you go. Girl. <laughs> Stephanie, Stephanie, uh, okay. Stephanie does say the downside of DNA. What's that? Can't commit any murders now. <laughs> yes. Well, oh my gosh. Put, uh, oh, thanks, uh, Patrice. Oh my nose. Um, 
this useless this useless knowledge had to come in useful sometime. I I just I am a book machine. Like just information, I just find random facts. Oh, it says Gaylene is in the house. Where is she? Yeah, right. So there you go. But yeah. Oh, there's Gaylene. I've been on here since the beginning of this was live. I didn't see. Here from Canada, so. I'm sure the government already has everything on me. I didn't see it. So there anyway. So, yes, huge days. Huge day today. All kinds of goodness going on. Yeah? Okay, it's been busy, yeah. Yep. So what's you guys been up to today? Yeah. Tell us. She better Tell change us. her pants than cause she, she was full of bloody paint. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, so this is the other thing that happened today. You guys know that I have a coaching club for creatives, right? And uh, I teach other people how to basically create a business and make money. I'm doing what they love because, you know what, I'm living the dream. And I know you guys can do it as well. And so I t share my secrets into a coaching club. Now, uh, we've got 150 ladies around the country. And Mondays we talk business. Wednesdays I take any questions, whether it's paint or whether it's business related, and ways I can help you guys. And on Fridays we let the paint fly. Well, today it literally flew, like, everywhere over my leg. I was actually, do you see that big shabby rose? I started working on this big shabby rose. This is how far we got, and I showed them how to paint this. Actually, both of these uh, uh, into funny. the group. And I was using our red apple, and some of it fell on my leg. And so I was saying to them, actually, let, let's just, this could be our question of the day. Mm. I want to hear from you guys. So when I walk into the gas station tonight, late at night when I leave the shop, probably like, you know, 11 o'clock or so, and I walk in, and I've got all this red right here over my leg, what should I say to the cashier? What would you say? Can you tell me where to find the black garbage bags, please? <laughs> like, you know, what would you say? Because I bet you you guys can help me come up with some really funny ones. Uh, oh, yeah. Go over to the three dots. Hit the three dots on YouTube and that's share. Yes. So, uh, okay, my results were, um, there was only a couple surprises, but not really. Because um, I'm mostly Swiss. I got... So he hasn't discovered any new siblings. Yeah, 24% French, 24% German, originating from Switzerland. 2% um, uh, Greek, 1% Sardinian. And then 49% uh, Northern European, English, Dutch. There you go. So there you go. Let this dry real quick, guys. And then I'll probably distress. Well, you. Carol, you better, you better share. So anyway, Jan Brown says, "I'm a bloody mess. <laughs> Can I have some money for gas?" <laughs> Who and what is Pete? Oh, love it, love it. Yes. This is Pete. He is all in one. Yes, he is. Shimmer, metallic, He's a sealer, and paint. Yeah. If you want to add shimmer, or you want to add, Whether it's uh, just, pieces yeah. or not. you can see really well on the board there, the bright shininess on the bottom is him as a paint, and then varying degrees a layer of yeah. coverage. So and there I'm you go. I'm going to go ahead and put him on some uh, black here just a second. We're just painting these thrift store. Candlesticks that I got at Goodwill. <clears throat> and now we're going to jazz him up a little bit. Does he have big ears? He does have big ears. Yes, you see him? He's yep. a cutie patootie. So, anyways. Yep, so Pete's the rock star in the family. You know, he's got big shiny dreams, right? Yeah. Over the top. <laughs> Do you sell the shovels? Place. Got any bleach? It scares me how much you guys know how to, how to cover everything up. Maybe that What's that? I thought I heard somebody at the door, but I think it was you. It was Pete. It was Pete at the door. Yeah. Yes. Got any shovels? That would be good. Is it all natural? It is all natural. Oh my gosh, that's too funny. Yeah. So there you go. All right. So we are good to go. So I try to pretty much get things dry, like, you know, 95% because I like to distress. And you can wet distress with our paint, right? Which means that. You basically, if there's any parts that your sand block goes over, it'll take the wet part as well as the dry part. On our website at jumpmonkeypaint.com, we have the sand blocks. These are my favorite ones to use because they rip paint real nice, right? Ooh. And I know there's color under here. So this alone is going to be like for somebody out there right now who's like, I got candlesticks and they're like blue and I hate them. Or, yes, hate what you got, right? Oh, yes. 
Pete's on special for the next 24 hours. He would normally be 24, but he's actually 20. Yep. And we're doing 2019 the is the year of the pig, which means it's the year of wealth and moving forward and doing all these things. So with that, we are taking the cue and we are waging war on high prices in the paint world. Keeping them low for you guys. We are keeping them low for you guys. Yep. Um, so we are, <laughs> do you know the number to the nearest crematory? What was, that <laughs> what was that movie we watched the other night? It was really creepy. Yeah. The, the, right the, auto the autopsy of Jane Doe. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. So, yeah, I saw that movie. Yep. Say it again because I cut you off there. Same hot gun. The autopsy of yeah. Jane Doe. Yeah. Okay. Same. Uh, Freaked me out. You guys see that on Netflix? Yeah. Same uh, drying technique with your heat gun. So. Yep. Hey, way, Georgia. My favorite tools for anybody new who doesn't know. Uh, Karen. I'm uh, my tool links over on jumpmonkeypaint.com. Click sign your yeah. favorite thing. Karen, he's up. He's under sealers because he's an all in one. Yeah. So just type in metallic and yeah. there you go. So basically, you got yours. You, it's one step for you guys. You don't have to like put your paint on, let it dry, and then put your sealer. It's all in one for you guys. So if you know that you want like a really pretty shimmery finish right. on a piece that you're working on, like I'm about to put on these pieces, I mean, that's all you got to do. And it's so easy, right? Mm. So look at this. <laughs> these had green and orange and white, remember? Mm. Now I have put uh, some junk monkey. We used our black velvet, choppy style paint, six of pretty much anything under the sun, tune it on the piece. That that's means I've got transformed uh, candle holders, and I love them. So that now... We ship anywhere in the U.S. Yes, we do. Yes, um, we might have a retailer near you. Look it up on our yep. line. Uh, so you can heat it. Yeah. Kimberly says it's just a vampire vampire bite. I'm fine. That's funny. I just <laughs> I just filmed a vampire movie the other day over with Sean. If you guys saw that, that's yes. what we were working on. So you can heat. Can you heat set jump monkey paint on shirts and bags? Um. Yeah, I, I'm but pretty sure you can. Actually, you know what? I can I can do that tomorrow and give you a definitive answer with my heat press. Yeah. If I want to put something on yeah. like a tote bag or anything, I just paint it with this on a stencil. Yeah. Mm. All right, and of course you saw me this past week do it on fabric as well. Yeah, I'm Martha. Put some midnight blue Martha, on. we're starting with Pete is champagne paint because he's like the middle color between silver, bronze, and gold. Yep. Uh, next one's coming out is silver. We're going to release one metallic a quarter, I do yep. believe. And then gold will be coming out. And then uh, copper, bronze. And then we got like uh, rose gold pink. Yeah. Yep. Uh, uh, pearl, um, black pearl, all kinds of stuff. So, anyway. How fun is this? I'm just taking my brush with my midnight blue. So, and I'm putting shot. it over this, like, what is this? A resin sort of yeah. tile. This is monkey shine. It's an all-natural furniture wax. Yep. Um, I would use it around uh, for cutting boards or butcher block if you had to. Um, it's all natural. You can smell it. It has no harsh chemicals like regular paint. It's very easy to work with. It actually smells really good if you're into it. Do you smell the monkey shine? Well, I like the smell of it. So there you go. So right. Can Pete stand piece. alone? Yeah. Absolutely Pete can stand alone. Midnight blue. Pete, Pete, oh, yeah. Blue. You can go ahead and put Pete anything you want. Yeah. This is this is Pete standing alone on the bottom, so you can see his shiny shimmer there. And this is various varying degrees of Pete on. You can see the shimmer he brings to the parte. <laughs> so and that's him in various degrees, right? All right, let's dry this real quick. Look at this, people! I love it. Ooh, mm -hmm. I love it. So I think I found this piece for what? Two bucks. Yep. Monkey shine. Two dollars and ninety-nine cents yeah. at Google. Yeah, Monkey Shine is a classic furniture wax. It does give it's it. So a, easy. Yeah, it does give it a kind of a satin sheen, shiny. Yeah, especially shiny, really shiny. Well on, yeah. Uh, wood. Wood yeah, dry loves, wood. Especially yeah. wood really loves the Monkey Shine. Yes, Monkey Shine does seal. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Wendy it says cats and dogs obviously love Monkey Shine. Do they? Yes, you can paint a milkshade, but with painting a milkshade, or uh, painting a uh, lampshade with any kind of paint. You gotta watch the heat. I'd yeah. suggest using an LED bulb. Bulb, Bob. Bob's your uncle. So we're Sharon the Adler. Share. Just know that you're changing the texture of the lampshade, right? Yep. So you don't want it to hold a whole lot more heat underneath. 
So I paint my lampshades personally, but I don't leave them on for a long time. And I also use a very low wattage bob for all of them. Yeah, Sharon Adler is checking in from Charleston, New Brunswick. I used my monkey shine on my old leather shoes today. It made them look like new. Yeah. You know, some people actually used it on uh, some of their psoriasis issues psoriasis and cleared it up. Pans. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. So it's Beautiful. it's good. Yeah. My service dog was named Copper. I miss him. Yeah, it's tough when those go. What was the name? What did it, you say she named him? Copper. A copper? Yeah. That's a good name. Yeah. Oh, it. dip your finger. Do the high spots finger paint. There you go. Yeah. 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 That's like a dry yeah. brush except yeah. with your finger. That's a dry finger. Right. What do you seal with painting for outdoors? Uh, banana peel? Yep. Or you can use peat. You got it. And then I always do multiple coats for outside because Mother Nature is a beast. Yep. And uh, remove anything that you can, obviously, like in the winter and stuff like that. Don't be like me and leave mm -hmm. all your stuff outside. Coming to Ice Fest, Fire and Ice Festival this weekend, yes. will your shop be open? Yes. Absolutely. Yep. We'll be here tomorrow. Of course. It's an Ice and Fire Festival. The Elf has got to be here to spread all kinds of joy to you little boys and girls out you there. So there Say you go. We will, be, we will be very festive this weekend. Absolutely. I'm going to go ahead and distress this piece. Oh. Mama loves some distressing. Look at that. Oh, a lot of people named their dollars, probably. Can okay. we buy the paint in Canada? You can buy milk paint right now in Canada? Um, Home Depot carries if there one could, I yeah, don't know that about, yeah. Perfect. Matt, I'm going to the casino for, for our birthday. I would join you usually. That would be fun. Yeah, casino would be fun. I like roulette. But I am on a compressed timeline this weekend, so. Because I accidentally started our carb load earlier. <laughs> yes. Look at that, how pretty is that, right? So this is just midnight blue over um just that brassy fake fake wooden piece for 2.99 that i got so i'm getting these set up because i'm going to go ahead and uh take pete out for a little drive courtney it is here pete is here waiting for you to take him home you got it all right so i'm right now putting a light coat of pete on these things um we'll see where we go from that and how much i want to build them up on here because i like to have dimension to my pieces right the metallic sealer is the only metallic that we have for sale right now so just like it's a brand new and it's a sealer metallic all in one yeah the other sealer of course is our classic banana peel and then if you like wax you have monkey shine all right shall we do it people all right in the peak hey oh, yeah, yeah what's up oh, so hey barb pearlized heaven brush yeah. to get again it does basically a distressed metallic effect it's a sealer do you sand if your piece got varnish on it, or can if you're using uh, if you're using mm -hmm. uh, the junk monkey regular paint, you just uh, you just paint on. It it will go right over that. I'm kind of being strategic because I want want it to look skipped. You know what I'm talking about? Because I'm doing this distress, and so I go all over it and add the sheen all over it. Or same technique as I teach you guys with paint. <laughs> regular paint i'm just doing the same sort of thing which right. makes it feel old martha if you're planning a trip to come see us uh, individually message us like yeah, a couple we'll sure yeah message us a couple weeks beforehand if you're planning a trip, if you're planning a trip to yeah especially to see us yeah, we so we can try to be here yeah absolutely because we know fun if we're on a conference call or something and you're here waiting to see us people, yeah i love it it's a sealer too it takes it hits yeah. everything so there Done. you go Beautiful. Let's let that set up now, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Settle down. All right. So as that dries, and we'll come take a look at it up close. Yep. All right. Let's go ahead with the other one. So again, I'm choosing to use a shabby chip brush. I could use a full coverage brush if I want. Those are on my website too, right? Yes. It's a very thin. It's a very thin medium. Yes. It's so really that way we can. Thin. We did that so it can actually um, give you different effects. Exactly. Because a lot of machine. times, yeah, a lot of times when you see, you know, different kind of metallics it's so it you have to buy one for everything you need for so you buy five products and spend 200 bucks when we take care of it all for you for 20 bucks there all you go sonia actually wait where'd that go sonia actually always reminded me of how Liv tyler looked on lord of the rings does okay. she spe speak elvish ah. only only when she's mad and it doesn't sound as nice as when Liv taylor speaks come on it. maybe if I, I just got mad more all white put a glow filter over yeah. my face. Yeah, if you're stenciling, be very careful because, yeah, it's not like the chunky one, right? Oh. Yeah. Guys, I love it so much. Look at this. It's setting up and it's drying and 
and I'm going to bring it closer. But look, we're, we have gone from like what was like, I don't know, some crafty looking. Um, Are you able to wipe it back? Nice. Absolutely, actually. Oh, 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 I love it. All right, let's let that dry. Put this over here and let's go ahead and do this one that we just did, okay? So again, this is like a plastic resin. We just painted it with a chalky style paint. Sticks to pretty much anything under the sun. I'm going to go with my shabby chip brush again, and I'm just looking for like a brushed over effect, right? This is really cool when you want to make, make things feel like they're just got that like metallic brush over, you know? And a tip for you guys as well, if you're especially looking to get more of like a very old look to your pieces, I'm going to come up close because this is a good tip, okay? I'm going to take a little bit of heat. I'm going to put it on here, a shabby chip brush. But what I'm going to do is actually do a couple brush strokes down like they're missing each other, and then I'm going to turn my brush the other way. So I'm making like plus signs. Make sense? And what that does is it gives you a very scattered effect, and as it sets up, it's going to like much look much more older, not perfect, because I don't like perfect pieces. Right? Yeah, what's cool about those little pottery pieces, Tracy, is they're not. They're wood, and they just look like wood painted... Uh, with ch chalky style paint, but once we put the uh, put peat on there, it actually looks like uh, pottery now. So, what does it look so like? We'll with let white this paint? set up in just a second, right? Um, let it dry. White paint, it, it darkens it a little bit, of course, you know. So, people are saying cross hatch. Yes, exactly. Yep. Yes, 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 yes. So, because, right. especially if you're not looking for perfect, right? Yep. Oh, man. I love the look of this. So, anyways. Yeah, thanks for your patience today. We're wait we're we're working diligently all day getting ready to launch uh Pete tonight. So we we this is a lot of work this afternoon. Now you see that? Now we're just playing. Do you see how yeah, nice that is? Yeah, and you can see it uh shimmer. So yeah, so if you put it on really light, okay, think about how I teach you guys how to use glaze. Yes, Pete can be and outside. When you put glaze over paint, you can still see the paint underneath it. Yeah. But you see the shimmer on the top of it with this product, okay? Uh, somebody you want to go heavy and you cancel out the paint if that's what you want to do. Yeah. Uh, somebody asked, yes. uh, what, how would you explain the texture of pea? Uh, very velvety, uh, metallic y, sheeny, yeah. glowy, smooth, liquid, yumminess. It just glides over your surfaces, right? It's beautiful. Did I do a good job? Hopefully, those were good. It made me it made me want to eat it. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> this is good stuff. I'm telling you. Look at this. It's beautiful. Does Pete play well with others? Could I mix a little petunia up with him? You mean to seal? Yeah. You could put shimmer over your well, I don't, uh, milk paint. I think what they're saying is can they mix a little bit of uh, milk paint in with it? I probably do would. You want to, you you want to try it? it? Not right now. I don't know. Okay. All right. But yeah, I wouldn't because uh, I just know milk paint is our dry paint powder. I don't think I would put any dry paint powder and have it suspended because remember this is a sealer and a paint all in one so i just don't it works with water but i don't know how well it would work with something that's going to seal and solidify right mm. Get what I'm saying? heat is not keto <laughs> yeah you got that right all right i love it all right let's come take a look no at i'm not eating it good grief <laughs> all right um okay so here we go shall we take a look at some of the pieces i gotta do this Last night we put this on with a little bit of Bahama Jade. Oh, let me I'm turn this. this as well. Okay? okay, let's take a look at this. Okay, give me hearts if you love this. Can you see the sheen on this? Can you see it? Yes. Okay, good. Looks very good. I love it, right? So you can do some like, let's say for example, this is the door of a buffet, and you want you put your color on it, and now you want to put a little bling bling bling, bling on it. You know, you use your metallic uh, sealer all in one, and then you don't have to seal again, right? Because you've got your color it in and your poly all in one going on in one thing right mm -hmm. um if so you could do all over coverage you could do a little bit like that like i just showed you with the what i call plus signs to make it simple for you cross guys. hatch cross hatching yes thatching hatching whatever you want to call it all right and then we just did these isn't this pretty mm -hmm. like we just did a head distressing and you can see how there's black showing through so i use my shabby chip brush to give me those skips okay it gives yeah. me the um just that old tarnish sort of look. All like of that, our right? products work together. So, yes. and we made sure of that whenever we were doing that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, medieval looking oh, effects. Yes. Uh, yes, exactly. Gilted. That way you don't have to mess with gilding. I know people want to do gilding with gold foil and stuff. Right. And this is <laughs> something This yeah. is something that we're going to do that's so much easier. And you're not even going to have to mess with that anymore. I know. 
So, okay, right. I love that. All right, so we're going to do this lampshade here. This is beautiful. And then remember I just did a little bit of <laughs> light on these, just like a really quick coat. I'm going to show you these. So this is just a really, really thin. Can you, I don't know if yeah. you can see it or not. I think Facebook froze up a little bit because we really... lost a lot of people, and I think they're coming back on. Okay. So I just kind of got that. So give yeah. us a second here. You know As what, we let go. me go ahead and... Yeah, everybody's saying broadcast interrupted, Ooh. but it's not on our end, so... All right. Come on, Zuckerberg. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and put another coat on here just to kind of show you that if I want it to, I could intensify... Jump out and jump back board. on. Yeah. yeah, jump out, jump back on. Somebody write that to help everybody yep. else who's trying to figure yeah, out. Yeah, everybody, even Gaylene. You know what? we got to be thankful, though. This is a free service that we're all able to be together with and to learn yep. together and hang out, so... We can't see anything bad. Sometimes we have glitches. You know what? There's even grown ones. Thank goodness we don't have those. So I'm going to let that set up a little bit more. Oh, I love it. All right. So that really showed it on the blue and the black for you guys. Uh, Light coats I did over here on these. Everybody is saying broadcast interrupted. Uh, talk to us when you get back on here. All right. I am going to go ahead because this piece right here. YouTube had a hiccup too. Let's go ahead and put some heat on here. All right. Do you want to restart this? What's that? Is it going? It, it everybody's, everybody's losing nice. everybody. Let me take a look here. Yep. Does it still say we're going live? Well, it's coming up, but we're losing. Like, we went from... Okay, 300 the whole way down. All right, let's go ahead. Okay, this so we're fine on YouTube. We hear you loud and clear. Thank you, Chris. We're going to restart. Pete broke the internet. He's just that good. Okay, we're going to restart. <laughs> we'll restart on uh, the Facebook side. Stay with us. Oh, wait, thank you, Jan, for letting me know that. All right, we're going to conclude this video, and we'll start part two on Facebook and pick it up from there. YouTube, you stay with us. Everybody's saying, come back, Pete. Hey, Tammy, how are you? Katie, oh, good. You came over from Facebook? Oh, that's a smart That's a smart girl. Katie came over from uh, Facebook. All right, we're going to hit share on this, and we'll do a part two in just a second. All right, perfect. Yay. All right, we're going to continue on as Matt goes ahead and gets our crew back on for on the um, Facebook. So, YouTube, it's all us just hanging out right here tonight. How are you? That didn't sound scary at all, did it? All right, we're going to go ahead and we're going to add some paint on this. So last night, I painted this in Bahama Jade, got it for $7.99, didn't have a shade, don't care. And uh, we put on the ball right there, so I love that as well. And now I'm going to do the same sort of thing. I think we're back on Facebook. We just got to wait for everybody to get back in here. Okay, perfect. So let's go ahead and add some on top of this, right? So if I wanted to, like if I had something that was just... Let me see here. I'm trying to think. Do I have anything on painted? No, Sandra doesn't have anything on painted. If I had something that was just brownie, brownie, as you, I could just add this. Okay, as you I guys think. jump back in on Facebook, let me know if everything's working fine. Up oh, here they come. You know that scattered sort of effect right. on here, right, with my shabby chip brush. All right. Okay, we're, right we're climbing, climbing the ladder. Woohoo! Climbing right. the ladder. So there Facebook you go. Facebook doing updates on a Friday night. What the heck? Yep. Somebody must be working late at uh, Facebook. <laughs> yeah, Zuck heard what you said. Facebook goes down and the world crashes. You, you will not talk about me. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to mellow out this color by putting a little bit of our um, metallic paint sealer all in one, a.k.a. Pete, who is the newest member of the Junk Monkey family on here. And it just gives you another dimension to your paint pieces, right? Guys, I cannot wait to show you like how you can add him as well on top of glaze pieces and the cool thing is you got your sealer all at the same time. I want to remind everybody that we're giving away a can of peat on YouTube, a can of peat on Facebook. So you're going to get an actual pack of peat. You know the peat that you get the ground and roll it out? So you <laughs> plus... Somebody's expecting some soil. <laughs> plus 20 big banana bucks for both. So That's there you funny. go. So anyways. I Yep. All right, all right, all right. So we're all back. We're all working fine. Oh, I love it. All right. So Let me you tell you the story. Uh, dry. <laughs> dry, clear. Pete and repeat. There you go. Pete what? Pete and repeat. Yes. Hey, Louisiana. Hey, guys. All right. Thank you for everybody going over to YouTube and hanging out with us. You guys are the best. Yeah, you guys are great. We have such a nice We're just day. having a good time being here with you guys tonight. So. Absolutely. That's it. You know what we should do? We should do a ridiculous 24-hour YouTube live challenge. Would you, guys, would you guys hang out with us for 24, 24 hours? hours? Right? Yeah. 24 hours. It was like a marathon. We'll do like...
cooking. We'll do like all this crazy stuff. We'll sit there. We'll read a book together. Oh my gosh. I'll sit and read a book to y'all. All right, give me a moment because I'm, while well, it's <laughs> Well, thank you for being here. Yeah. Oh, where's where's Marie? Where's Marie? Marie, you posted a thing about yeah. Yeah. Uh, you posted a thing about roasted radishes. I love radishes. Oh my gosh. Yes. 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 Or down below on Facebook at the top on the um, Everybody's going, oh my god, I'd hang out. Yeah, pajama. we'll have we'll have like a pajama pajama party. Pajama. We'll have pajamas. Everybody's twenty four hours of mat oh god. What is the easiest way to get the clips off paint can? Take a butter knife or a screwdriver. Here, let me show you. Let that dry. Let me show you. Remember, give them time to dry. You put them on. And then you can actually see where you add them and let me, give you time to clear right, out and show right, the blue. Right. See this? Okay? See this? Just, right, just take something underneath. I just have this lying around and just okay. go underneath like this yeah. and go. Pop it up. And it pops right off and you can just awesome. take it. Wow. Well, I listen. Like that. Boom. And you're right off of it. Oop. Right. You're right off. You just you pop it off. I just there use a flathead screwdriver. Yeah. Well, I just had. I just had, uh, yeah. I, I tried to cap it. things Ooh, like yeah. this, like flower pots to hold, like, my little whisk that I have for sale in my shop, because oh. I love to reuse. Don't but stand too, it's still too I long, you could get plenty. This just has a little bit of the end. Monkey thon. Oh my god. What we, is it? A monkey thon. That would be brilliant. I don't know if anybody's ever done, like, a 24-hour marathon. I don't know. We could always be the first. So. Listen, live your life like nobody else. Boy, I'm going to be all wired out on like uh, Red Bull. <laughs> so Matt, hey, Aloria is here. Aloria! Hey, Pete just got here. Yes. Pete. Is so when you. So, here yeah, so when you come back to work this week, you're going to have a lot of Pete to pack. <laughs> you're going to be a. You're gonna Pete. Packing, packing sods yeah, you're going to be a Pete packing fool. Oh my gosh. So I'm putting it all over my antique lace, and I got to tell you, I love it. Thank you, Darla. And I let, hey. just let it dry, clear, and blend Darla right. Connor said she sent us a customer today from, she met at a resale shop. Oh, thank, thank you very you much. Thank you very much. It's because of you guys that we are able to continue to bring We you will be able to conquer. To we will be able to conquer. Yes, and be able to give you superior quality products at superior prices that don't break the bank, okay? That's our commitment. The war on high overpriced yes, paint. absolutely. Can't don't believe that. Don't believe the hype. So that is a solid. Ooh, was that painted that. something before? What this? Antique, yeah. yeah. This was uh, antique lace. With so paper. now it's antique lace with paint. Yeah. And so he's got he's sealed and he's got some shimmer. But I keep saying, <laughs> once you put paint on, aka the metallic paint right. sealer all in one, give it a chance to set up because it comes clear and more iridescent. Yeah. Okay. Because that's the poly part that's in paint. Remember how I tell you when you use banana peel? Turn one down. You could, it's when you put it on, you can actually see because we have a guide into it. We've also got the guide Hey, Dusty. Here. So when you put it on, you can see where you put it and where you haven't, and then give it time to come clear, okay? Dusty says, hey, it's Dusty from Cloud9 Floating Beds. You can get in on the Junk Monkey Slumber <laughs> Party. Look at this guy. So, yeah, if it was only four hours on Facebook, what we do is just restart every four hours. That so we would fun. do our programming every four hours. And you know what we should do? I'm getting excited now. This is all your idea. <laughs> okay. We should do a where we like beam you guys up. Do you know what I'm talking about? We Bring you online. You guys. Yes. For those of you who could like, you would like basically be like, pick me, talk to me. And we'll put you up on the screen. And, uh, you know, maybe we could talk to you about, what are you doing tonight? What are you doing? You know, Were you like, still wanting to collab on one of the beds? Oh, I think that was a gentleman. That was Dusty McCauley, yeah. Yes, I, talk, I remember who you are now. Absolutely. Yep. Um, yeah, if you're around, come in and talk to me again. Or email me at jumpfuckingpain.gmail.com. Yeah, we'll, guys, we'll, we'll work you into the slumber party. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, wouldn't that be awesome? That's a local gentleman who uh, builds beautiful beds out of wood. And well, thanks, like Tracy. Them. Yeah, share the love. If you're out, share the love of Junk Monkey. You know, we not only does it help us. Yes, it does help us. Of course, we're people but, find out. At the same time, is we want to, yeah, we want to help other people. Like, we wish there were people around to help us when we first started this. Yep. 
So, you Good know. Community. You got a place to go and hang out. Okay. Right? As soon as it's dry, I will bring it close up. Yes. But I'm not to, I'm not about to touch it right now. <laughs> so, I'm putting this on. This is you guys may have seen me do this. Do you remember when um, I was a featured guest on Home Talk and they asked me to basically teach tutorials on their platform? At the time, they were doing a lot of live videos and they reached out to us and asked if we would work with them. And so we went on to their Facebook page and we would go and we would teach tutorials very, multiple times a week. And what's really cool is they are the world's uh, biggest online DIY, like DIY online marketplace community, right? Mm -hmm. They're huge. They have like what, seven, eight, nine million people? This is brand new, Kathleen. It just, so we just brought it out on this, this broadcast. Was, this frame was one of the things that I did on there. So you may remember me doing this. I just painted an old frame in antique lace and I put some chicken wire into it, and I showed you guys how to do that real easy. You could just hang this on your wall, but I always kept it for my shop. I loved it. So uh, they want to know it. where the owl came from. The owl, I bought this one. I want to say I bought it from one of our retailers. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure it was Chrissy up at uh, 119 Antiques. And Chrissy, if you're on, be sure to tag the business mm -hmm. below. I'll tell you how you can find her. If you go to our page, jumpmoneypaint.com, click find a retailer, look for 119 Antiques. Anyway, she has a vendor that does like really cute owl stuff. This was one of a couple. Donna owls sold a china cabinet that yes. she painted in Stormy Forest. The buyer loved it so much. Well, thank you guys. Uh, Stormy Forest. Is so, nice so I haven't talked to Sonia about this. So okay. I'm telling y'all because y'all had to convince her okay. that I want to bring some of your projects that you guys have been posting on Jump Monkey uh, Paint Projects. Okay. And put it on our main website to show everybody what you guys have been doing yeah, totally with our paint. Yeah, I'm so I there you go. I started to do that before we went to Canada this past summer, and I had to put it on all hold. Maybe it's now time to revisit it. <laughs> you could have a guest like a doorbell ringing. Well, we are in Mr. Rogers' neighborhood. We are, yeah. Or it could be Pee Wee's Playhouse. I don't know. I think I'm going to let a little bit of that come through. It's, it'll probably start off like Mr. Rogers, and then by hour 19, it'll be like, Pee Wee. Ah! <laughs> do you think that we could, we could stay away for 24 hours? Maybe I could, yeah. but you will be over there regretting your life. Oh, I will. I, I definitely will. But that's why I say, you know. <laughs> Matt will turn into a very oh, angry, if I don't angry get, beast. If I don't get my sleep. Yeah. I yeah. know what happens. Yeah. Yeah. Don't have to tell me, dude. 20 years of it. Yeah. Hello. You yeah. know what I'm saying. Yes. We'll have to feed Matt like, I don't know. <laughs> what do we feed him to keep him up? <laughs> yeah, you got that right, Dusty. So, uh, What's he saying? He said he'll have to bring a bed so we there can, somebody can nap, right? Oh, that'll be too funny. <laughs> funny. Yes, that will we'll go live from uh, one of your uh, bed platforms. Yes. And we'll talk all about, you know, we'll paint. We'll clear up the uh, store. We'll have the store. Uh, we'll set it up. And wouldn't that be a Maybe bad? start with 12 hours. Oh, uh, Teresa, you know us. There, There is nothing. We never we never do anything halfway. We have right. to do it's it. All or Yes. We are just, you know, we're doing 30 days live. Can Clara come visit for a mukbang during the 24 hour marathon? Two? Sure. Funny. Sure. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Oh my gosh. Uh, be, I'm going to have to plan it with Adam and David and the cards. Oh my gosh. We have to plan. We'd have to plan this out. It'd be so crazy. All right. So I've got to let that dry. Remember. So, Pam says. Pam. All in one, let it dry. Pam Krigger. Actually, the town I grew up in was yes, called Krigger. But it's not a town. It's Let's like five houses. Right. But uh, she said, yes. she said, and I know this, but I want to mention it, Jeanette Patton has done a lot of beautiful pieces with your junk monkey paint. Yes, she, yes, she has. Yes. Right. Paint the bed while Matt naps. Paint the bed while Matt naps. I'm sure he'd be painting. She would paint me. Yeah. This is a mirror that I painted and put our chocolate Jeez, we're just, over we're just painting everything tonight, yes, aren't we? I know. Everybody's going to come in tomorrow and be like, did you clean? No, I just added glitter to everything. It sparkles. Oh, this is it. this is bad. This is I'm bad. not gonna put it on my chalkboard though. Okay. I had somebody call in today, and she came and she got her paint. She called and she said, and you might be ever watching, do you guys uh, carry a chalkboard paint? And I said, yeah. You would just use our chalky style paint. You put it on, grab a brush, grab bananas, put it on whatever surface you want to turn into a chalkboard. Even supposedly it's a mirror, whatever you want to do, you just don't seal it. That's all. The uh. moment you seal it, you have a fully finished piece of furniture. I'm sealing right now with our metallic all-in-one, and what's going to happen is I'm not going to put it on this part because I change out. Um, this is like my pricing board, right? And, and there is there. still no Linda Linda. I was happy she called me today from California. 
You didn't tell me Linda 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 called. No, you called. were talking, you were in a meeting. Oh. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, my phone rang. Um, uh, she actually called me, so we talked. Uh, yeah, we're good. Yeah. She's alive. She's well. All right. All right. Let's look back. Well, you know, I, like I you know, I get worried, you know, about people. You know me. Look at that. Still tagged, still on there. Still proud to say I got this one for seven ninety nine. It sets clear. Um, it set once it. I, yes. Yeah. It, it does. It brings yeah. your shimmer forward. Yes. Let so. it. Yeah. So you put it. Who on. needs to clean when you can paint? Yeah. Uh, if anybody knows me, I'm like Mother Hen. I, I guess okay. it's the sergeant in me. Okay. But when yeah. I don't hear from people, I'm like, we're so and so, we're yeah. so and so. I do that all the time. You like to check in on people? You do. If I only accent with Pete, you know what? what would happen if the sealer got one, Pete? Nothing. Nothing. It would just be an extra you sealer. Could, could There's it. Linda, Linda, Linda. You could put another um, layer. Oh. She was just being quiet. Guys, look at this. This was a fun one. Oh gosh. What? What happened to her? You. Why? Because this is fun. She's just yes. grabbing stuff Listen. now. But he's like, what in your life, okay? So right here, this was just a um, cutout that I got at Walmart. This is a great idea for somebody who wants to create a cute little chalkboard, whether you got kitties or you're trying to do decor or something like that, okay? You want to just create positive mm -hmm. thoughts to yourself, all right? Mm -hmm. Bagnaz made some positive thoughts at Well, I just saw you, Tanil. I just so, saw you. Yeah, I don't know. It might be a this is just, thing. So I could take right now my chalk and write anything I Yeah, want. Katie, you're right. She is just pulling whatever is in eyesight. Yep. She's pulling. This is what I do. This but now, once, but this is a good example of, of course, how it's going to change this. Shabby piece. swag tutorial but tutorial on the monkey thon. It's not a chalkboard anymore. Yeah. On the monkey marathon. What? A shabby swag tutorial? Yeah. We can do that. Yep. Because it'll take a while. All right. I'm going to go ahead. I'm using my shabby chip brush to make this owl have a little bit of bling bling, okay? And then he sets up, and now he goes from a velvety flat black mat to a beautiful yeah, and I know, right? Maybe I'll put a little bit on the outside. Yeah. yeah, if you uh, if you see uh, blotter from Ligonier tomorrow about you know somebody out painting all the new uh, <laughs> all the new lights and signs, eh. can you paint over Pete? Absolutely, you can paint over Pete. What are you doing? Seriously, I'm girl. Are you trying to get all rid of that whole paint? What? Are you trying to get oh, rid of all of You still have three quarters of a can. Dude, I got more than three quarters of a can. Yes, I got three quarters and 99. Yeah. .99. Maybe if you do the 24 hour, you could schedule different retailers to FaceTime with you and introduce. That would be awesome. That you is a great idea. Projects. That is a great idea. You guys set up in your locations with a project and be like, yeah. hey, we're tuned in. Who suggests that idea? Uh, it was on Facebook. It was Mama. Mount okay. Mama. I was going to say, I don't know. Because she has West Virginia on her thing. That would be fun. And what we would do is we would be like, hey, we're connecting with so and so today. Let's see, or tonight or whatever. Mm -hmm. Part of the day it is. Well, I have some shimmers of dry. Mm -hmm. All right, let's uh, get some of these dry pieces and see how they turned out. You ready? I'm, I'm ready. I've been when ready. You were talking. You were brainstorming here. So mm -hmm. I was like on a roll. You know, you were leaving me. Yeah. All right. I might also have something to do that I've got almost 30 days without sugar, and now <laughs> I've had sugar starting last night. Mm. The sugar wasn't supposed to start, because you guys know we do keto, okay? So we live a low-carb lifestyle, mm -hmm. and it's been working out wonderful. Ask right? her if Hang a on. toddler bid would suffice. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah story. Would... Matt's trying to direct it to yep, something else, fine. but i got to tell you. So we do 30 days on keto, and then we do a carb up, okay? That's our cycle. And so, um, you know, Matt's birthday is coming up on Sunday, which also puts us at the 30 day, 30 well, day mark, Well, we're going early. Right? We're starting early so, because I made a mistake. So, one of the things we love is um, diet peach tea. So, I see you, Gaylene. Mm -hmm. But this is not diet, is it, people? Because Matt picked up full-on sugar. And so, I forgot. After I drank two of those <laughs> last night, which are 40 <laughs> carbs apiece, and I live my life in a 20 to 30 carb style for an entire 24 hours, I blew out my carbs, okay? So I'm like, well, Dan, we start the party early. So I've been on sugar since last night, so Pete's in the house, got my DNA results back, now I figure out who I am, and uh, Matt's birthday's coming up, and so uh, I got a little extra energy to burn, okay? You know what I'm saying? I had two, like, cocoa. I had candy, I had, yeah. I had M&M's today. Oh my I had, yeah. you know, I had We're a little bit wired tonight. Yeah. We're a little bit wired. Yeah. So as I sit here eating more peach tea that has 
Caffeine. And then Sunday we go back. Yeah. Anna says, local businesswoman arrested for vandalism. Everybody Told police she wanted to town the shimmer. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe that gazebo up there needs a little extra shimmer, you know? They only paid, what, a million dollars for that? Shay I think it's three million. I think they missed a spot. Yeah. Okay. Shaylin says all that sugar explains why she's painting if everything. If shimmer shows up tomorrow, it was not me. <laughs> What's that? She said, Yeah. all that sugar explains why you're painting everything. Yeah, right? And it's fun. It's yeah. fun. It's addictive. All right, let's go through what you painted so far. Okay. Let's because I don't think this is the end of it. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. We'll, we'll work our way through. Okay, let's talk about it. All right. Oh, my. Oh, let's talk Galen about says, it. My birthday is yes. today here, Matt. Because. It's her birthday? My birthday in New Zealand is already International Dateline. Galen, I'm still waiting for you to send me those Powerball winning numbers. Please. <laughs> Come on, oh, do you know how much paint? Do you know how much stuff we can do with that money, all of us? The oh. email is... Paint galore. What's yes. the email? Jugmonkeypaint at gmail. .com. There you go. Yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm, i got to slow down. There's always an inevitably one, um, one person that comments in on every live. She talks way too fast. Right. And so, let me slow it down. Uh -oh. All right. So, here's what we started with, all right? Sonia decided to paint the entire shop. All right, so first we started off, I had these uh, bowls that I got at the dollar store, and I added, I already had them painted, but I went ahead and added some peak to him, which made them really, like, really iridescently pretty, and mm -hmm. gave them dimension, and so now they're going to go back, and I'm going to fill them with all kinds of stuff, and they're going to be awesome, right? That was Bahama J, Sunshine Yellow, and the uh, Sweet Sunset, Okay. I decided to add some shimmer to this box that uh, I created. That's over our whole vlog over on YouTube. All right. And so then we did these. These were two ninety on a piece. We painted them first with our Jug Monkey Chucky Style paint. We distressed and brought some of the original colors through. And then we did a dry brush in our new tonight that we're announcing and sharing with you guys. A way to add some extra dimension to your pieces. When you want a little bling bling, want a little shabby glam. And, uh, yeah, I think it really upped this piece versus just having them painted in a flat uh, matte black, right? You guys love those? I love, love, love them. If you're looking to order Pete, Pete is under sealers, brushes, and more. You got it. Yep. Because he's a multi. Just shop button. He's a multi person. And I, was, here, I got to turn this a little bit because he's like super. Sure. And here's shiny. what I did tonight for you guys. Instead of you having to use a code to save a few dollars tonight, since tonight is our launch of him, I just went ahead and set him on sale. So for 24 hours, grab him. All right. He's four dollars off. Yeah. There you go. Help you towards your shipping. All right, so this one was a planter that had um, antique lace onto it, and all I did was go over it with him to give me that little bit of bling bling on its edges and totally different dimension, right? So the champagne, like I told you, works with silver or gold. It's the in-between, and so every shabby painter, every painter should know that champagne needs to be in their toolbox. For clients who can't pick between the two that are worried about being pigeonholed into one or the other, it's a beautiful, just beautiful. So... This would go in a room that has silver. This would go into a room that has a lot of warm gold brassy tones as well, right? Because it's almost like a beigey sort of thing, right? Works great with grays as well and just warm vintage colors. So this was our um, midnight blue. And then I just distressed a little. And then I went over it with, again, with her, uh, with her peat, right? Love it. Give me some hearts if you love that one. And of course, Jesse did, says playing with scissors. You're right, I am. Look I'm at like, him! And I don't even, I don't even notice that. She, you know, she, she must have heard that? it. Yes. Okay. I'm over here like crazy. When you're over there chopping scissors, what are we doing? I think we're. It's I the sugar it high. Must be the sugar. Matt's, Matt's got energy to burn. Literally just standing there, opening, and closing scissors. We're crazy. All right. This was Bahama Jade over. Solid the Bahama Jade. Yeah. Yes. Right. Oh, love this. And I applied this tonight, of course, with our uh, shabby chip brush. So I use a shabby chip brush when I want more of it. What's your hair, Sonia? Right? Isn't that yes. beautiful? Oh, yeah. They love it over, Wendy loves it over black and the homage. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, yeah I love really. it so much. All right, let's take a look. This was, I got splatters, but it's okay. I dry brushed this over gray, right here, gray wood. This right here, I put another extra coat on top of it. This is what I'm talking about, full coverage, okay? So you can go light if you want with a shabby chip brush, or you can use it full coverage if you really want, like, drawers. It, maybe you paint uh, a dresser and you want your drawers to be a solid, right? Put but Pete this is a sealer car. as well. What's that? Yes, Pete is in the shop for you guys this weekend. Oh, yeah, Pete's here. He's here. He's here. All right. So same thing. 
very, very light coat, all right, that I put on my Bahama J just to give me a yeah, very, very turn light. Turn it in the light so they can see it shimmer, like, like rock it back and forth. There you go. Okay. Yep. Very, very light on that one. That she even painted half the radio earlier. I did. So, there you go. Don't judge me. You look like Alvin had coffee. Yes. Let me see yes. Here. Okay, so this is one of the ones I really like that it's on me. So, again, antique place, but we put that, put our beautiful iridescent peat over it, okay? And again, I just dry brushed it. So, you can see where the, when I use that brush, it gives me the skips. And quite honestly, um, you don't have to wait until peat completely dries on your thing. You can just go over them heavy. I'm going to bring some of those corners. I don't know what that look was I because I was looking reading, so. I'm not sure what the question was. It was, do you have to wait for Pete completely dry yeah. to add extra bling to Pete? add extra bling. I, uh, would bling. Do, I do one coat at a time. Really? Yeah, okay. I don't want to mess up because remember, you got your sealer built into that. And I right. always teach you guys, don't mess with your sealer. Let your sealer dry naturally, okay? That's, that's why don't you're the queen. It. So do you're going to get more professional finish. If you put a light coat on, and just like when you're dealing with regular uh, banana peel sealer, light coat, let it dry. You can, if you want, you can buff in between if you want more of a professional finish. It's a very <laughs> light grit sand pad. Do another light coat over it. Okay? Yeah. So um, it says, can you use peat over petunia? Yeah. Yeah, peat, yeah absolutely. absolutely. So it's the same sort of thing. Now, basically, you got to think about, think about this product because it's dual. It's two in one. So, Jesse. And instead of having two sealers, now Junk Monkey has three. Yep. We have the Monkey Shine, which is the all natural wax oil finish. We have the Banana Peel, which is a clear poly. Mm. And now we have a metallic poly, which is when you want oh. to add a sealer that has bling bling into it. Okay. Right? Got you. Real yep. quick. Yep, go for it. Jesse DeVore brings up a good thing. Yep. Step away from the Pete, ma'am, for the love of God. <laughs> um, Mel. I my light. All right. Mel. Go home. Mel says, where did you find your owl at again? You, the from owl, the... yeah, that was through uh, one of my retailers. When we go out, we set up retailers. I love to support them. And so I hunt for stuff in their stores that make me happy. And I bring them back to a part of their store and support them. And I'm pretty sure this one came from my friend uh, Chrissy at 119 <laughs> Antiques. So if you message her, you'll find her. If you go to junkmonkeypaint.com, click find a retailer and look for 119. Does wiping it back to stressing uh, dim the shimmer? No. no. No, it's on wherever it's Drive intact. Yeah. It yep. yep, you're good. So, yeah, so you're putting it down and then you're letting it clear itself out. And really nice, yep. right? That's why you don't want to keep touching it. Put it on, move on, right? And add more if you need to once that's right. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure there was more stuff that I come back here. Oh, yeah. This <laughs> was, uh, what? <laughs> what? No, I didn't What? Look at this, guys. Gray, can you see? You might be able to see it on this one a little bit more. Yeah, can you I, see that? I'm when I'm, right with bling bling. Let me tell you something. When you switch over and do the carb cycle, yes, I can feel my hair grow right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh man, it's crazy. like, you know that part when you get him to the Greek where he goes, stroke the furry wall. Yes, the fur that's what I feel wall. like. Yeah, we I need, need a furry, furry wall, wall right now. Holy we need smokes. A furry wall. Sugar is so bad. I never noticed it since I've been off of it. It's like, my gosh. Oh, my Lord. Uh, the retailers well, do not have show. peat yet. So we just got peat. We just got peat. Yes. Actually, you know what? I heard from a lot of our retailers today. Uh, J. Sam's in Nova, in Nova Scotia. The only thing available to Canada right now is the milk paint line. The milk paint collection. We are working so hard right now on getting our brokerage taken care of for Canada. So the rest of the collection will come soon. The, yeah, it is. We are working on it. We are so sorry, but you're going to have to come across the border yes. and, and smuggle it in. I actually moved here from Canada. So let me just tell you, I'm taking care of my Canadian friends and family. You yeah. just hang tight. You stick with us and we'll get you covered. So hopefully we're going to see some movement on that in the next, I would hope, like four to six weeks. Yeah. Look at this, guys. Isn't this pretty? Oh, my gosh. I love it so much. Uh. I love it so much. All right. Why are you, taking you guys are going. Marie says you guys are going to crash hard, and that's why I took a deep breath because I know it. Where can I get the milk paint? You'll see on our website, junkmonkeypaint.com. You can see it on the Canadian collection, and there's all kinds of uh, tutorials up there for our owl you. With a little yep. shimmer. Go darker. Make them darker. I think I am. Go. I was going to go the other way. Go. What do you feel about that? Go. Do some see light. what happens. Go. Just go. Do some, go. Um, 
The schnozberries taste like schnozberries. I know, right? You know what? Maybe I should paint them the other way so they can really see when you add in a second um, coat. Let's do that. Let's just pretend I was trying to make this owl just be. Let's um, just make him owl. like. Let's make him made out of gold. Okay, that sounds good. We're gonna make him like gold member. All right, gold member. Yeah. All right. In case Bridget Osmus is in junk monkey dropping fly over. Ah, Bridget. Bridget. Well, no, that's what Kayleen said to Bridget. Oh. So, yes, we love Bridget. Yes. Yeah, Romy and the late, great Radar. <laughs> uh, you guys are killing me here. I have to stay to the end. Uh, I'm sorry. We didn't mean to wake you up early. This is the show that never ends. Yes, yes, it goes on and on, my friend. Yes. Some people started watching it not knowing what it was. Okay. I continue I, I, watching I, I, it forever just because you know what happened. Go, go, go. Hurry, hurry. Matt's going to be running laps around the building. You don't know how true that is. Now, we let this dry, right? We put it on. We let it dry. All right. So now we just stand here and look at it. Yeah, I just nailed this. This is 40 grams of carb, 39 grams of sugar. Yeah, yeah. I really yep. feel Yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, I feel like a lot Yeah. So now we just let Is this dry. going to be the 24 hour one? I, I don't know. No. I'm looking. We're like 70, 70 minutes in. If we keep going, no, we, we can't get, because we'll get a head start on it. <laughs> yeah, we can't because I got to go hop row house tomorrow. And, you know, it's gonna be like I gotta have some energy. Yes. So whenever you know Bavarian brats are gonna be there tomorrow night. Okay. So when they're doing like polka version and of these are not food items. These are no, actually this is the band. So when polka they're doing water. yeah, when they're doing the polka version of uh, Don't Stop Believing, yeah. I got to be ready. Do you think we should show them tomorrow night what goes on? Oh yes. Our yes. 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 Could yes. Could you guys handle the hits done by accordion? Yes. With sausage? Yes. I mean, <laughs> and pretzels? Do you guys want us to show you tomorrow night what goes on? Yeah. Everyone's in a great mood. Oh. We, uh, we're not in bed at this time. We go out with everybody else. Well, we're now. usually up till like 3 a.m. anyways. Yes. We do some of our best work at doing. like... Now, I'm going to do what I tell yeah. you guys not to do, which is I'm going to speed this up a little bit. Uh, but I'm not, I'm not somebody who wants to be messing with trying to force sealer. I don't like it to air dry. But for you guys tonight, I think I see a Sonya hair in there. Wonderful. Yeah. Right. yeah, if you've never been to a Hopra house, whether the original in Germany from 1589, oh, yeah. but I'm telling you, the one in Pittsburgh where they're dancing on the table and singing Polka ACDC and stuff, it, it's it's brilliant. Can they it's see it's brilliant. Can they can see that? it. Okay, I good. think we should go darker. You think we should go darker? Yes. All right, well, then I'll, I'll teach you. You just want me to keep painting, don't you? Go! <laughs> He's such a supportive husband. All right, so here is the deal. Listen, people, I might not let this video go on replay. <laughs> we can't save it till the Jesse morning. says... What will people think? Jesse says, take it from me. You're going to hate, hate, uh, hate life in the morning. Uh, sugar um, sugar rush is like heavy drinking. Yes. Well, then I should be golden. But I'm telling you, we haven't had sugar in a month, right? Correct. And we usually do carbs. And we usually don't go like this. But the whole thing is, is we have... Uh, it's my birthday weekend, so... It's his birthday? Yeah. It's his birthday? Yeah. Okay, so let me teach you that. Since Matt, as uh, every, <laughs> every swiggy takes, he's like, okay with me going with one more layer deeper. All right, so now we put two layers on, right? This is a good example. So I told you, you heard me say it earlier, I got a son here in there, right? Poor Riley. Riley's so, in bed already. He, yes. He's like, he's like the our old man. Yeah, us. our son is the old man. Okay. So this, I'm going to go in for the third third coat okay now i'm using a shabby chip brush if i truly wanted all over coverage i would just use a full coverage brush but i'm building it up slowly giving myself still a distressed sort of look but if you ever have to if you want a more uh, finished look so i don't want to put on another coat and have a sonya hair that got stuck in my sealer so i could take a sand pad and i could you know i could go ahead get one that has your grit worn out or is like maybe a 120 grit and what it does is it won't rip your paint and all you're doing is polishing it so right. when you go to add your next layer, if there's a fly that landed in it, or a hair, or anything like that, it comes out. But I gotta tell you, so I'm gonna you, use this one. You guys probably kicked yourself out of Kita. Absolutely, we have. Yeah, we, um, we do this yeah. every once a month. Pete is definitely water based, so I used to. I'm running. Distress I, metallic. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? Look. Oh, that's a look in it.
So before well, we happy go, birthday, Trudy. It's her birthday, too. Happy birthday! Riley is the responsible adult. He is, actually, believe it or not. Oh, I um, love that. Look at that, guys. What do you think? The stressed owl, like the yeah. little metallic, brought a little yeah. bit of the, uh, the, you know, the flat matte chalky style paint back. Yeah. All right, we'll go ahead and put one more coat on it because... Matt says that I yeah, Tess, right? if you're in the Hofbrau area, come have some schnetzel. Oh, wouldn't that be fun? Oh my yeah. God, Tess, she would be like, she'd be a maniac. You think so? Yes. You sound like you know something else. That's gonna be all worried. So, anyways, um, yeah, we kicked ourselves out of ketosis. Actually, I kind of, yeah, I do the cycling. Like this week's different because it's my birthday, but I try to cycle my ketosis. Like I used to do when I was uh, doing like, you know, competitive, you know, competitive type lifting. So I kind of run it in the same cycle that way, you know, I can give my liver a workout. I can do different things, you know, so I keep I all the systems. Was, everything yeah. in balance, right? Yep, absolutely. So, but yeah, but it actually was not supposed to start till tomorrow until Matt accidentally picked up completely. You should take Clara there. I will take PJ, right? I will take PJ Clara's husband there because me and PJ are on the same wavelength, being Marines and stuff. And we, you know, me and we took to each other right off the bat. I think Clara would be scared. What's that? <laughs> Going to Hoffer House. Uh, well, we'll, we'll, we'll show him tomorrow night and they can decide. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and wait because Linda. Linda it. says he doesn't have a choice with Matt. Matt as a dad. Oh, yeah. okay. well, she's right. Anyway, look at this, guys. Isn't this fun? Love it. So now we let it dry, right? Yeah. Improperly, you don't do what I'm about to do. You never force your sealer. But for you guys, I am. Because I want you to see that it does dry clear. You just let this do it on its own, okay? How old will you be on Sunday? Too old to remember. It's been many moons since the deer jumped across the stream. And the wind blew cold. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my word. It's been decades. Love it. Do you see how he's coming? Uh, oh, happy it's... birthday, Diane Early. Really? Yes. She's having a birthday weekend too? She's on Super Bowl Sunday. Oh, that's so awesome. What is Super Bowl Sunday? That is not this weekend, but next weekend. Oh, is it? I'm yes. Not. All right, I'm just here for the halftime show. 29, huh? All right, just making sure I get any edges because it's got a lot of edges. I'm just going to do a little finger around the edge so that my sealer didn't go over and I'm not left with anything. But not as old as you, Guys, Gaylene. Think, Gaylene. Can they see him? You're spring chicken, Gaylene. I'm going to put this on my display so that when people go, what color does this come out like? I'm pretty sure after you see all these things, you'll probably get a really good idea, right? Yep. Yeah? What do you guys think? Gaylene? Happy birthday, Cindy. Do you approve? All right. See you all. Okay, my favorite picks tonight, love the owl, love the owl, love the, um, by the way, last chance to share before Matt hollers out $20 in banana bucks for two people, one on Facebook, one on YouTube, and plus Me too, Barbara. two cans we're giving out tonight, one on Facebook and one on YouTube as well, so four names are going to be announced in just a second, look at this one, what's your vote, what do you love best, what's the best project? Candlesticks. Spring chicken. Uh, that's a saying around here. That means somebody who's young. Decor. Young at young at heart. Young spring Planter. chicken. Planter. Love it. Frame. You know, mm -hmm. or the other frame as mm -hmm. well. Leia. What was what called your name? Tonight? Oh, I love it so much. What called my right. name? Yes. Sugar. Oh, we're so bad. <laughs> we're so bad. It's okay. All right. Good time. You want to show them that uh, pink bowl again? Memories show them the, the pink bowl. The pink bowl or yep. the pink bowl? Pink the bowl. pink bowl. Okay. All right. Sure. Can Love everything. Oh, this, can is so pretty. this is um, the shimmer that we have over the uh, Sweet Sunset. Yep. Isn't that pretty? Yep. Oh, I love yep. it. Love it, love it, love it. And again, I did these in very distressed yet glammy fashion. Glam. You know what I'm talking about, right? There's such thing as, uh, you know, a rustic glam. And this is what this product can be perfect for. Oh, let me, let me point down with here on YouTube because I'm yeah. like, I'm like ignoring my yeah, cameraman. Yeah, see you bad, lovely Pete. God love uh, you. Uh, Big uh, shiny uh, dreams for your furniture. Whatever else you want. All right. Okay, Matt. So. You're going to have to help me here. 
I'm gonna have to You're going to have to help me here. What do you want me to do? You, you're going to come pick on Facebook. All right. Let's pick somebody on Because I got shaky fingers. All right. He got shaky fingers. All right. Uh, Boom. Amy Clausen, right there on the screen. She's a sharer. She's a giver. She's a lover. And she shows up and she supports us. Let's go ahead with Amy Clausen for $20 in banana bucks, girl. So email me at jumpmonkeypaint at gmail.com before midnight tonight, Eastern Standard Time. Put winner, winner in the subject line. And I'm going to shoot you back a code that you can use uh, to get $20 in banana bucks. So you can use it towards getting yourself maybe a little bit of that lovely Pete shimmer right there. Get yourself a lovely can of this goodness right here. Rustic glam. Oh, yes, absolutely, girl. Takuma style. All right, go for it. You want to holler at somebody on um, YouTube? Oh, I love the shimmer that we can see here. All right. Pat Paku? Yep. All right. Pat Paku, that is you. Hey, over New on York YouTube. City. You're going to also get $20 in banana bucks, but make sure you redeem it by emailing me at junkmonkeypan at gmail.com before midnight tonight, Eastern Standard Time. And let's go ahead and also throw out, we're going to mail you this, okay? And if I call a name that happens to be in Canada and we can't get it to you, then what I'm going to do is we'll, we'll make sure you get something really good and juicy, all right? Mm -hmm. So a can of Pete to each one of our uh, people out there tonight. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pick somebody here. Do the hokey pokey with my finger up, down, all around. See, we love New York City, and I love seeing New York City. New York City is the city so nice. They named it twice. Right. <laughs> you're funny. Chen says you're all cheap date dates. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? This yes, one, Matt loves me is. so much. You know that, right? Oh, man. When I was dating her, I loved it. We went to the bar. One pink polar bear, she was in the bag. Oh, my gosh. Oh, you were dancing on the table. Oh, what? Yes. Well, apparently yeah. I don't remember Remember, that part. remember New Year's Eve? It wasn't <laughs> even New Year's Eve, and you were wearing the New Year's Eve crown. I don't even know. Yeah. Listen, don't I tell them my secrets. A girl has got to have a little mystery in her life, okay? All right. So, all right. I am going to send a can of Pete to I'm a Giggling Fool. On YouTube. From Arizona on YouTube. So, I'm a Giggling Fool. Girl, you need to email me at jokemonkeypan at gmail.com. I'm sorry. We had to go tonight. there. It was just too good and too You're appropriate so for tonight. Listen. This, this video might make replay if you're lucky because you guys are going to know, like, you, you're gonna, you saw too much tonight, okay? You're going to be scarred forever, all right? All right, Patsy Reed Robbins. Oh, and she says, my whole people say that I talk too fast, too. Listen, we get a lot done, right, Patsy? Patsy Reed Robbins, can of Pete going out to you tonight as well. And just to, so we're all on the same page, no, you won't be getting any, uh, any sod or uh, soil. It will be truly metallic. What are you doing over there? Kicking the stuff. Oh, goodness gracious. What are we going to do? All right. Oh, we had so much fun tonight. Oh, all right. So who's in for the 24-hour marathon? John I, Monkey Marathon. I, I, and then this might have been, this might have been a totally bad idea. What's that? We did this while we were totally high on sugar. Yes. So absolutely. anyway. Pink polar bear. It's like a white Russian, but with strawberry we milk. We make pink polar bears. Together. Yes. How about that? Yeah. Oh. Yes. And it involves ice cream. No, now I'm getting confused with the grasshopper. Yes. Grasshopper, that's good too. Jump Monkey, the last oh. episode. They'll only talk about it in whispers. <laughs> we will we'll hide this video later. <laughs> you guys are so awesome. Thank you for making it so easy and for uh, just allowing us to be able to be ourselves, to have fun with it, and to spread a little love. And oh, my God. Wendy said yum. I don't know how you could do that. I I, I don't know. Said, White what? Russian... I, I'm thinking back to it now. I mean, that was probably the most disgusting drink ever. Really? You love that thing, though. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. 20 years and I still have it. Absolutely. Yeah, it was good stuff. I don't think you had it in 20 years. That's what I'm saying. 20 years ago, I still had it a little bit. Yeah. Oh. Absolutely. Oh. Okay, guys. We're going right. to call the night. We're going to we gotta try to, like, you know, we'll still be here. Well, we still, got, we still got, like, six, seven hours you of work to do. You don't want to end this video, do you? I don't know. I can tell. I can't. Yeah. We've only been on for 85 minutes. What's another What's another 85 minutes? I mean, how many minutes? We started at like, we started like almost 10 o'clock, didn't Message we? Message Riley, tell him he won't be home. He's never <laughs> home for 24 hours long. All right, we'll see him tomorrow morning. All right. All right. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Everybody. Joanne, it's a date. She's going to make poly sausage. We're down. Let's go. Is she close by? I don't know, but okay, we're down. Get there. We're down. All right. I'm we're down. down. We got it. All right. All right. See you guys tomorrow. All right. See ya. Bye. Bye. Go to yeah, for $4 off. Yes, absolutely. Whoop. Thank you for supporting us, guys. Alrighty. Forgetting a can of the very first run of Metallic Paints ever here is Jeff Monkey Paints. So. Be safe this weekend. Yes.
Yes. All right. All right. Enjoy sugar. See ya.